A horrific crash caught on camera. A black Mercedes plowing into a Los Angeles intersection Thursday afternoon, killing five people, including a baby and a pregnant woman, plus injuring eight, according to authorities. The cars erupting in flames. Saw things flying in the air in the explosion. And all of a sudden, the, the, there was a baby flew in the air all the way from the middle of the road to my pump, landed on the floor. The destruction widespread with dozens of first responders rushing to the scene. Of the eight people injured, six were minors, including a 13-month-old baby. Most were treated at Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center and all currently recovering from minor injuries, according to authorities. It's very obvious from the video everyone's seen at this point that it was a tremendous high rate of speed, at minimum at least 50 to 60 miles an hour. The driver of the black Mercedes suffering major injuries but surviving the crash and now in police custody. California Highway Patrol arresting 37-year-old Nicole Linton of Houston and forwarding charges of vehicular manslaughter with gross negligence to the L.A. County District Attorney. Witnesses at the scene shocked by the carnage and beginning to mourn. There was no brakes, there was no horn, nothing to indicate that there was something wrong. No one really knew except within another second the explosion occurred. And Aaron joins us now in the studio. Aaron, I know this is very early in the investigation, but is there any indication that, that she might have been under the influence? Well, it's one of many outstanding questions at this point, Gotti. California Highway Patrol telling NBC's sister station that shortly following the crash, she was administered so much pain medication that an on-site toxicology test was actually not possible. So still one of the many outstanding uh, unknowns at this point. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.